still an ongoing situation here in Sri Lanka following those suicide bombings on Easter Sunday uh, on hotels and uh, churches in Sri Lanka, which claimed more than 250 lives. Uh, Sri Lanka is still very, very much on high alert. Uh, the pres president in the country has also announced that uh, two uh, local groups have been banned. They've been linked by authorities to these uh, attacks. Uh, there have been ongoing raids, ongoing arrests. There was also that uh, shootout uh, last night, local time, um, in the east of the country, on the east coast, uh, in which uh, we understand that 15 people were killed after security forces found uh, what they believe to be a safe house for Islamist militants who may be uh, connected to the bombings on Sunday. Uh, apparently, some of those suspects uh, ended up blowing themselves up, um, claiming those other lives uh, in, in the location. Um, there's also, in another site, um, uh, pl uh, police and military also found explosives and um, what appears to be ISIS uh, uniforms and an ISIS banner uh, that also uh, appears in another video uh, when ISIS uh, claimed uh, this attack, which has also been uh, linked to those local organizations. Uh, there's another curfew in place here tonight until the early hours of the morning as security forces continue uh, to search for, for suspects who are understood to be on the run. But uh, Sunday Mass will be cancelled this weekend and indefinitely at Catholic churches because that is seen as a, as a huge risk in this situation.